Well, great opportunity for Albuquerque with the Albuquerque Film and Media Experience. We call it AFME for short. First of its kind in Albuquerque. It could be very much like Sundance, Cannes Film Festival. It's, it's beginning here in, in a big way this year, uh, June 3rd through June, through June 9th. We want to make sure people get out and support the event. We've got great actors, world premieres, 80 films, uh, uh, six brand new premieres, uh, films from, in, uh, from Israel, films from the United Kingdom, films made right here in New Mexico. And there's going to be some charitable components to this as well. So we just want everybody to get out there and support AFME in this inaugural year in Albuquerque. It uh, creates great economic development opportunities, plus it allows people to see our city in the very best light possible is a great place to, to live and make movies and to be creative. And so it's a wonderful thing for us. We're excited about it. Hey, so the city was one of the first sponsors uh, got so, right in when it was announced. Is that because you think it might have a positive impact on economic uh, uh, the economy here. Well, absolutely. First of all, it's, it's great economic development opportunity. We think $3 million in direct spend could be uh, generated by this event. That's people eating at restaurants, uh, shopping in shops. But it's also more than that. It's a very international event. We'll have people coming to Albuquerque from all over the world. It gives them an opportunity to see our great city as a creative place to be, as a creative place to work. And if that leads to additional business ventures from filmmaking to other artistic endeavors, well, we think that's a wonderful thing for Albuquerque, and this is a great place to start with that from, uh, from the standpoint of really starting what I think will be a world-class uh, film and media experience festival here in Albuquerque. And uh, you talked earlier about uh, being a Thomas Dolby fan. <laughs> yeah, she blinded me by with science. I mean, that was one of my favorite songs in college, and he's going to be one of our featured artists this year. So Thomas Dolby's great. If you haven't uh, heard him for a while, if you haven't had a, ch had a chance to check out Thomas Dolby, you should. He's really one of the great electronic artists and, and uh, does wonderful things. And he's not just an electronic artist, but he's uh, he's one of my favorites. And so we're looking forward to having him come to our great city. You're going to dust off the albums before you go and oh, listen I, to I, I, I've got Thomas Dolby on my on my uh, on my MP3 now. So yeah, yeah. Uh, no, it's, uh, uh, I, can, I can take you out of the car. You can listen to some right now. Right on. <laughs> hey, so uh, not to put you in the spot, have you decided what other events you want to go to? Uh, as far as this event goes, I will certainly be at the Highland Theater on Friday night uh, for the conversation with Robert Redford and uh, Mr. Lynch. I will also be at the Saturday events, and uh, we'll be uh, doing a little traveling in the middle of the week, and then I'll be back for some of the great events for the weekend. Thank you very much. Thanks.